Hey guys, it's Silver496 here, more welcome to my friends, welcome back to Minecraft, and uh, today I have a very uh, special thanks for somebody actually, but first I gotta make a quick double check. Um, when we last left off, I didn't actually uh, do much, I did do a bit of um, shearing of uh, sheep and a bit of um, killing of cows, but I didn't really get all that much beef. Um, the, my uh, main purpose was to get leather, obviously. Um, and I also got some, uh, Podzol from a wandering trader, and, uh, oddly enough, one of his llamas clipped through my house, and they had to leave the lead behind. I don't know why they did that, I didn't kill the llama or anything, I swear. Um, but, yeah, I got a lead, for whatever reason. Turns out this axolotl isn't the rare axolotl I was after, this is just a white, this is just a boring white axolotl. But, uh, an axolotl was, it's, it's whatever. Um, it'll work. Uh, now, I... Know that uh, it's obviously not mandatory to get um to get like leather hats and everything. Hold on, um, guys. Uh, there we go. I know it's not mandatory or helpful to get leather caps or anything, but um for one of my uh, future projects, I really want to do this. Um and uh it's probably not going to take a very long time if I was on creative or survival. But um anyway, this is all I die and wool. Um uh, I also traded with them, as it says here. I got what a deal. Was this successfully trade with the villager? No duh. But yeah, after all that, I'm intending on uh, going back to the nether. Today. Going back into the murky depths of hell when I should never have strayed. Um, there were a lot of things I actually um, sorted through last time. I primarily just arranged a couple of my chests. I was intending on getting one of these. I also got this golden sword from a um, uh, fellow that died when he fell out. Um, it's pretty much destroyed, so I, I was just going to break it down, um, just melt it down to a nugget, but I figured that I could trade it. With big ones. That's what I'm planning on doing today anyway, um, and my diamonds, they're helpful. So I was actually going to, uh, make, they're not really being much help, just hanging around doing nothing. So I was actually going to make a, uh, diamond sword. Probably a waste, but I want to do it anyway. So there we go, got a diamond sword. Boom, I am now jacked, and is anybody outside? Hello? Nope, nobody's outside by the looks of things. But, um, I wanted to, uh, ah, yeah, I, 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 like I said before, I went out and got some food, the, uh, uh, before the episode, um, dropped. Uh, also, I, like I was saying before, because I can't remember anything, um, I want to thank, uh, somebody a uh, hell of a lot, um, the only reason I didn't thank them in previous videos is because, oddly enough, as probably as crazy as this sounds, a lot of my videos actually made, I actually, uh, make my videos and then upload them after a day or two, um, but I wanted to thank, uh, BJW173, because they are, um, an animator, and they are recently uploaded a, uh, video. Well, I guess more of a poll. Um, they uploaded the poll, and, uh, asked, like, uh, what they should be doing, uh, for their next, um, animation. And, uh, if you go and watch it carefully, you'll see Worship is something that I... I would uh, relatively enjoy being uh, voted for. They uh, pinned my comment, actually, so I'll thank them for that as well. Um, but yeah, uh, please do go check it out. I want to keep this sword safe, so I'll put it next to these. Oh, so that's tough. I thought it was like a deep slate or something, but um, yeah, all them are, all these new different blocks are really starting to like confuse me. I was thinking on doing a bit of fishing, but I figured that that would be a bit boring, so I might do it in between episodes. Um, I also want to get some more blaze rods, so, um, well, rods, I guess. I got some flint here, some feathers would be helpful. Yeah, some feathers. Oh, those are my shards. <laughs> um, 
I uh, actually watched uh, Wadzi play a, um, do something the other day, um, and he had a spyglass, and basically wherever he looked, it turned like diamonds or something, and I couldn't actually believe I was watching um, Wadzi mine diamonds. After after everything he's done, I think he would expect the diamonds are like for peasants. I mean, I expected it anyways. I mean, I didn't really expect him to mine, but I did expect him to mine diamonds, obviously. I know diamonds are probably like really par of the course for some people. Um, but what I figure the way I figure, the only thing I've really wanted to do is obviously not get to like a really high level like uh these like uh some people, because I mean like there are people out there who are absolute gods at Minecraft, like, you know, I'll name a couple. SP737, Wadzi, um, and yeah, I don't think I need to name any more because, I mean, there are loads more, but I don't want to name them. Because, I mean, this, this is really not mandatory. People know they're gods at Minecraft, and I mean, I'm, I'm just, I, I don't know, they obviously don't have, like, Eomania, but I don't really want to just, like, feed anybody, like, information, because, I mean, obviously you can find them yourselves if you like it. But uh, yeah, most in most cases, I figure that you can um you can probably uh find like I said, those are uh, like godlike Minecrafters yourself. I mean, there's also Skippy, BBH, Dream, Technoblade, Tommy and it. Will assert all those people, they are famous as heck, and I mean, I'm not saying that I'm better than any of them, but, um, yeah, feel free to look at them, I mean, from what I see, they're, um, they're sort of like my, uh, unintentional supporters, because Tommy and it's younger than me, and he's, like, way more famous, so, if he got there just by doing Minecraft content, then so can I, I figure, but, um, I mean, Obviously, almost nobody's watching my videos, so I figured that, um, you know, it's gonna take a while. It doesn't matter, though. Go figure. Uh, most of the stuff I do is... Oh, you're wearing enchanted boots, are you? Yes, you are. I shouldn't have grabbed the, um... Oh, never mind. I, I shouldn't have grabbed the water, I was going to say, but, um... I think it was actually a creeper that, um, this place up. I should probably patch this place up. Probably just cover it completely. Oh. Well, the power of the course, because I've got to actually get out first. I was intending on uh, going there and trading some gold, but um, actually, let me check my ow. Oh, let me check my armor. Iron boots. I need some gold boots. I think I made some already. Yeah. Uh, so I'm just gonna grab um, I'm just gonna grab uh seven, say uh seven gold. Stick the boots on. Throw what isn't mandatory in a chest, like that, and that, and that. Actually, I might take the rotten flesh with me as, like, last resort food. I'll put the egg in there, though. It's not the best food, but it's food regardless. Um, I was thinking about doing a lot of fishing in between episodes, but um, I figured, like, if I caught something really valuable or really precious, you guys would want to know. I might just, like, upload a video just like a fishing escapade, but I don't really know for certain if you guys want to watch that. And here we are, welcome to the nether. Hello bro, how you doing? You alright? You doing grand? Fun dandy and sour candy, I take it? Um, the nether is, like I said before, a place where a lot of people sort of just, like, want to let their hair down and be all, like, Tickety-boo. But, um, me, that's not the nether for me. 
the nether for me is a place where you've got to be absolutely mega doubly careful because look at my stuff iron like you're joking so I mean, the people who just strut into here to do whatever, the people who are cautious, careful, experts, and wear diamond armor. I do none of those things. Well, not yet, anyway. First, first I gotta close my curtains, guys. The sun's getting in the way, so I can't see too clearly. And I'm back. Sorry about that, everybody. I truly am. Uh, let's see here. I didn't really come for any particular reason except to maybe uh, spawn proof this place a wee bit more. Well, it doesn't seem like there are many people here anyway. That I'm not saying that's a bad thing. What's that? That stuff. It looks like cobblestone, but it can't be cobblestone because... Last I checked, cobblestone wasn't in there either. Oh, yeah, great. Um. I'll go this way. Place some torches while I'm here. Just to get some. Oh, that. Uh, that is uh, from a crimson forest. That um, that stuff looks like grass. That stuff looks like red grass. That's from a crimson forest. That means a crimson forest should be nearby. And if Crimson Forest is nearby, then I may as well get going. Uh, also, the, uh... I don't really know if I want to go to go back to uh, Five Nights at Freeze anytime soon, but, uh... Literally, my stomach was turning itself into, uh... I can hear a ghast. A uh, blaze. Well, I can see that magma cube. I can make magma cream now because I know how to get where to get slimes. My mate told me the best way to um kill a magma cube is to uh hit it while it's in the air. Oh, I can see some magma cream there. No, nope, excuse me, guys. Um, I want to get that. They said don't bother wasting um your. Pick a, uh, they said don't bother wasting your arrows on them. They're best used against slimes. Can you guys actually deal damage? No, you can't. Excuse me, coming through. Okay, maybe you can deal damage. We'll camp out in here for a little bit to regain some health and to get that magma frame. I can make potions of fire rares now, which is good. Yeah, we get it. We know you're there, wherever the hell you are. Just shut up. God, don't smoke, kids. That's why. You'll end up sounding like that. I wouldn't know. I've never smoked, actually. I have... I haven't smoked in my life. A lot of people have been like, Oh, you should totally try it. You should totally try it. But um, after seeing one of my friends chew down packets and nicotine gum, I decided against it. Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, a saddle! That means I can get a horse. Yeah, I know you're there, Ghast. Whimpering, whining little douchebag. Yeah, we know you're there. If you if you show your face, I'll pump you full arrows. I don't care if that sounds morbid as freak. That's what'll happen. So it's not really morbid, it's more truthful than morbid, but whatever. No one cares. I don't. Now, I wanted to do some trading today, but, um... Now I just sort of want to get out of here and be safe, uh, and I'm going the wrong direction. It's like, it's like they're pressed, like, directly against me. I'm just like, bro. So, hello? 
Hello guys, how you doing? You alright? How's things fellas? Um... Where's the ghast? Should have brought a pickaxe with me. Whatever, it's pretty, pretty easy to break this stuff anyways. It's pretty fast to break some stuff, but I don't really want to get out quite yet. I know I've gone through these ways because, um, it's, uh... Oh, hello. Apparently these guys are like 2.7 blocks tall. Um. Ow. You didn't drop anything. Holy crap, that was fast. Took about a one shot. Well, that's a, uh, Basalt Delta, I think. No, Basalt Deltas are those, like, really rugged ridges, aren't they? I can't recall too clearly. Those ones are, like, a uh, fossil, like, uh, Soul Sand Valleys, I think is what they're called. I'm not used to all these, uh, new... All these, uh, new things. All these, uh, new maps and everything. Well, not maps. These new, um... The new areas, I guess. Um, I mean... If I had enough blocks, I would build... I probably actually do have enough blocks. I will I will build down there and go say hi to those piglin... Piglin... Pals. But, um... I'm worried about the lava. And the full damage, and the fact that I might not be able to get back up. Maybe I'll speed bridge. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not Dream, I can't really do that sort of stuff. I'm not Dream or Gog, so... There's a little snippet there which I can walk down with. Um, but I think what I'm going to do is go back to the overworld, snag a pickaxe, and uh, yeah, let everything work. Um, oh, and it's still dusk, so monsters haven't quite started spawning yet. When I first started playing Minecraft, I really wanted to be like a professional builder. Like, I really wanted to go out there and get known for my builds. Full Wish J already sorted that out for me, so yeah, I don't mind anymore. Um, but what I ended up doing was um, building a bunch of houses, like with uh, very nice thatch roofs, you know, like um, with hay bales. Um, I actually made it because my mum suggested I do it uh, for her. Uh, so I did, and uh, she uh, then um, I went to display her her house, and she asked why it was on fire. Um, I looked back, turns out I had actually um, put a fireplace in there and had set her roof alight. Fortunately, fortunately, the um, main area stayed relatively unharmed because you know it was. Efficiency. That can be helpful. It's enchanted, after all. and But, um, it's already pretty fast to mine in there, so, uh, even without a pickaxe of any kind. So, I might just, uh, make a stone pickaxe. I don't know if I can make a stone pickaxe out of tough, but whatever. It might just be a waste of time if I try, so I won't. Um, cobblestone. All these new blocks are really getting a bit on my nerves. I think I'll be taking that. Now, uh, let's see. I don't know if I should put the gold in here as well, because all my gold gear is in here. But, um, hey, chum. Hit the sack. Wake up early, and I'll see what happens. Toasty. Using my overhang to your advantage again.
The uh, good thing about the uh, sun is that uh, it kills the skeletons, and as you can see, there's some horses over there that I want to get. But um, I don't know if I want to get a horse now or later. I don't know. Um, but the crux of the matter is, is that I was um, I want to name them, and I can't really do that if I uh, don't have a name tag, and I need a name tag as well, and I get those from naturally generated areas. Uh, naturally generated chests, like uh, the ones you'd find in dungeons, bastions. I think uh, I think pig step, pig step is pretty rare as well. Uh, that's like a still put this up here. I'm still waiting for powder snow. But I can only get that when it well, obviously starts to snow, and then I'll get light as a rabbit, which is uh, the thing I get for hello bro, which is what I get for uh, walking on leather boots. For whatever purpose, I somehow don't sink. Hey mate, how you doing? Well, um, enjoy your stay here. Just try not to enter uh, my house, as one of your unfortunate brothers did. I think it was a brother anyway. Might have been your sister. Get triggered. I don't. I don't really care. It's dead anyway. So. Pour myself some more coke, and let's see. You okay, bro? Just don't go for a, um, uh, just don't go for a zombie trip down there, because, uh, then you'll die, and that's not fun for anybody. See you later, bro. Jumping back in the nether. This time with a pickaxe, and iron sword, and some other stuff. And there is a gaze. Ghast. Why don't you go and, I don't know, talk with Sonic the Hedgehog or something. Oh. Ouch. My ankles. That is all broken ankles right there. Um, let's see. I have some uh, nether axe, so I'll build with that first. Uh, actually, I'll just start by trying to get up there. Fortunately, those pig ones aren't very angry at me unless I mine nether gold, uh, glazed nether brick, or whatever near them. Um, what if they clash, class as even the uh, tiniest bit like gold, they get pissed off. I don't know why. I'm guessing they're just greedy. Hey, mate. Um, I was talking to the zombie pig, zombified pig one here, not any of you guys, but, um, hey guys, what's up? Um, now, Nether um, gold is very helpful. It uh, primarily drops um, uh, nether, uh, gold nuggets, but uh, it can also be used to uh, it can also be used to uh, trade with pig ones. And if you mine it with silk touch, you get the ore as it is, and then you get to uh, basically like you know. block that off. One less thing to worry about. Now, I want to talk to a piglin and see if I can trade. Oi guys! Uh, let me find my way around this lava. Man, this place is hard to traverse. All these jagged cliffs and rolling hills and treacherous areas. I don't want to trek too far from um, the, you know, Ow! Oh, I found the Crimson Forest, and uh, there's a chicken jockey. Uh, a zombie piglin. A zombified piglin chicken jockey. So I don't like how they remove zombie pigmen. Now, hey guys. Got a trade for you. 
Hello? Hey chum. Uh, don't, don't trade with the, um, little ones. They just run away with the gold. And don't give a crap about you. And don't give you anything back. Hey mate. Mm -hmm. Uh, hold on. Hello. Um, yeah. This is the new, uh, trading mechanic that everyone was crazy about. What did I get? Gravel and nether brick. Alright, how about this? Let me see what I can get out of this 10 gold. Oh, I got a potion of fire res and obsidian. A crying obsidian. Uh, I think the main reason a lot of people trade with these guys is to get our uh, ender pearls and, um, and, uh, usually some other things. But I don't know, uh, for certain, like, what. Um, I know, I think one of their, uh, trades is a netherite hoe. And, uh, oh, I got, um, is that blackstone? Yeah, and regular obsidian. So, um, they also trade with them to get ender pearls. Thanks for the bricks, and thanks for the, wait, a water bottle. Why'd I get a water bottle? I didn't even know there was a trade for them. Maybe it's valuable or something to them. Um. Oh, hi. Why you? That was a gas tear where it's dropped into the lava. Probably should have, you know, made this place a bit less hole filled. Why was that guy running? Something strange is going on here. That guy was running. I don't know what he was running from. Or maybe running towards. What's he doing? He's running from or towards something. Mm -hmm. Hello. You're running about. What, what's what's the problem? Maybe he's concerned about the blaze over there or something. Um, I'm mulling over everything, trying to figure out what's going on here. Um, uh, here. I don't want to do this, but I'll prove it. Yeah, see, he's pissed off at me now. Yeah, I think he's ticked off at me. Bro, where are you? Anyway, I think he lets out a little, like, uh, alert to all his little mates. I don't know where he went, but whatever. Don't mind if I do. There were some, uh, striders down there. I know they're the best boats in lava. You used to be able to settle, uh, baby striders, but you'd, uh, take damage because they were too short. I don't know exactly, uh, like, all the schematics of these new, um, of these new mobs, but, um, I know that some of them are good. And I don't think the zombified pig ones really give two shoot, two shoots about this stuff. Yeah, I'll, if, if, um, if I mine that near them, I don't think they care. If I wasn't near them, then they don't care. If I was near real piglins, they would probably get ticked off. Hello, mate. Hello, everybody. How are you doing? Oh, a lot of gold nuggets. I don't know if I can trade these. Let me see if I can. I think it's either gold or gold nuggets or 
whatever it is, but, um, where were your less zombified brethren? Oh. I'm not trying to shoot this thing. It's just gonna plop in. Oh, no, never mind. Doesn't look like it's gonna plop into lava after all. We can somehow get it to come down here. I might be able to get that. Uh, I might be able to get the tear, but I'm afraid it'll drop into the lava regardless. Or it might fall over there. I don't have enough blocks. I mean, I doubt I do anyway. Um, there's a baby zombified piglin, but I don't. Um, there's a baby uh, piglin, but I don't want baby piglins. I want the uh, adults because they actually have decency. They have common decency. Uh, okay. I think I still have a lava. I don't really mind. I still just want to kill it. Yeah, that dropped into the lava. I don't really mind, so long as I'm not, like, in severe danger. But... The, uh... Main reason I came here was to actually get a- Oh, hello! Uh, can I- Can I try gold nuggets with you guys? No, I can't. It needs to be gold gold ingots or gold gear. I don't know if that was ever possible, but I don't know if they pa I, I it might have been possible at one point, but I'm guessing it was patched. Considering it was like a uh, important or like a uh, an easy way for some people to get um. Here we go. Crimson Forest. I'll be damned. Crimson Roots. I've heard this place is helpful in several ways, but, um... I've heard you can get, uh, like, pork chops from here, from the, uh, what are they called? I think they called them, uh, hoglins or something? I don't know for certain, but it's something like that. And apparently, the, uh, hoglins and zombified piglins hate each other. Or, well, the hoglins and piglins are the bim. Don't know why it is, maybe, maybe it's just, uh, maybe they just burned that bridge. No pun intended, because I'm in the nether where everything's burning. I'll just take these mushrooms with me. Take some humble button tops with me. White button mushrooms, those are a type of mushroom, right? I know there's also the chanterelle, the enoki, the truffle, there's a lot of mushrooms. I think those, um, those, like, tall, thin areas, I think those might be a, um, I think that might be a basalt delta, but I'm not 100% certain. And besides, I'm not going to build over there. I don't want to get too lost. Weeping vines. I don't look very sad. I don't know what we're weeping about. Mind you, if you had to grow in an area like this, I'd probably be weeping too. There's a hog one. I think that's what they're called anyway.
I've heard these guys deal a ton of damage. And apparently they can take quite a bit of it as well. There we go. Hog one down. Now, I need to mark that down in my book. So, uh, because I marked down a bunch of, um... I marked down all the hostile mobs so I wouldn't forget which ones I killed uh, when I... went to, you know, um... when I went to go to get monsters hunted. So I killed them. Hog one down. I also need to get the zombified hoglum, which is basically just getting one to the overworld. Of course, you don't really... You shouldn't saddle them because, well, one, they aren't a thing to be saddled, and there's another one. Apparently they're also afraid of, um... Didn't think I'd hit it. Apparently they're also afraid of, uh, warped fungus for some reason. Don't know why. I'm not exactly like... I'm not, I'm not like the authority on... Oh. Bro, getting in the way is not a good time. <sighs> you know you're a real pain, Ghast. That should have had it. I figured that would have had it anyway. Oh my god, I'm terrible at this. Wait, can it seriously not see me? Got on down my last arrow. Don't know why they're running around. I guess they're just more agile. Gotcha. Did you drop anything? I know it dropped something, but I think it... I can see that they dropped some gunpowder, um, and some more XP down here. Don't know if it dropped a tear. Don't think it did. I don't think it dropped a tear. Don't even know if they're guaranteed to drop a tear. Mind you, um, it's a pretty rare resource to get anyway, considering gas are flying, annoying. And usually float over the lava, so... But they're very weak, so... Two shots with an arrow, they're dead. <sighs> Let me think. Actually, I have an idea. It's not really a crazy idea, but it's an average idea. I'm gonna... Come in here. Never been a fan of this new stuff, but whatever. Crimson stem, crimson plants, crafting table, and... Well, with this crafting table, I think it's pretty damn obvious what's gonna happen next. These torches should lead me back to home. Let me look it up. Gold, here we go. Ah, uh, what? Ah, uh, no, I... I don't know what what happened there, but um Is that a block of raw gold? Eight gold ingots, exactly. Now, I gotta find some pig well, I would like to find some pig ones. Ambient music pitching in. Not spooky at all. There's a pig one, but I don't want to go down that crevice, so I'll just find someone else. There's some guys. Fellas! My fellas! Oh, there's the, there's the kid following them. That could be a problem. Unless I find another one, but...
God, these guys are annoying. Piglin, piglin. Oh, there's a piglin without a kid. Hey, bro. Hello. You were you running from a zombified piglin, bro? You have a crossbow. They have swords. And you just fell and hurt yourself. I'm not sure you're as smart as you're cracked up to be. Here you go, Matt. There's some gold. Trade with me. I'll stuff out these fires. Spectral arrows. Wait. Yeah, spectral arrows. I don't know if they dropped those, but hey. The more you know. Soul sand. Bro, bro, you realize I'm like directly into a sense of value, right? Oh, thank you. Thank you for more spectral arrows. I can use those to, uh, enemies to get glowing, I think. And a fire charge, that's helpful. Uh, now, I think there's something I can do. Like, uh, if I tick these guys off and then throw gold at them, I think they get angry. Yeah. I think I get an advancement. Yeah, oh shiny. Put on some boots, and now I should be fine. Thanks for the leather, which I didn't really need, but I can use. Oh, that's a good grab. In the pearls. Thanks, mate. And some. Um, was that was that another piece of obsidian? I don't know. Um, but I, right. I got something that I wanted, or at least one of the many things that I wanted um, from these guys uh, and um, what the hell happened now? I don't know as long as they aren't ticked off at me uh, guys uh, do you mind if I you know get back up I sort of want to go home excuse me excuse me oh shit are they angry at me? No, they aren't. Uh, I was afraid they might get ticked off because I, I uh, pushed one of their friends off. But, um... I guess I got lucky. Well, um, that was a lot of worthless trading with the piglins. No, not all of it was worthless, mind you. Some of it was okay. Uh, for example, my Ender Pearls, uh... I shouldn't have... Uh, what did you get? Is that what happens when the rain happens on the piglins? They get like, I don't know what that was. Strength? Weakness? But it's raining, which is good, because that means it's snowing over there. And uh, snow means that I might be able to get some powder snow shortly. See, if I was uh, playing Stardew Valley right now, I'm sure I'd be delighted that all this... Um, Rain is falling and watering my crops, but the thing is, I'm not playing Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley will probably come out in a bit, though. Seems as though my uh, Stardew Valley uh, videos are getting more watches than um than these, oddly enough, and which is sort of strange, but I can understand it. People like different things. Um, now leather goes in uh, here. Fire charge as well. Um, I've got so much gold that I'm. I mean, I'm pretty much flush with it. I don't really need any more, but, um... And my potions are here, which means I can also put that potion of fire res in there. And a water bottle. Um... I'll put the stuff that usually... That you'd usually find, like, in the nether in here. And, I mean, obsidian is probably something that I'd put in a different chest, but at this point I really couldn't be bothered. Uh... Let's see, do I have any mushrooms somewhere? No. I can put them in there, though. Next to one another. Now. I'm gonna have to go back and get some more blaze rods sometime. Alright, oh, yeah, I got it. I hear pillagers. Hello, brats. What the hell do you guys want? I've killed one of you before. One of your captains, no less. Stuff off. No one likes you. I'm sure I speak for the nation when, I'm say, when I say that. 
I don't even they like each other. Now let me think. What do I want? I want to uh let's probably switch out these for a start. Doesn't take damage, or at least not much. Um because the golden boots there are still perfectly fine. Oh well I guess it's vaguely scarred, but it doesn't matter. Gunpowder, sweet berries, rotten flesh, drops. I wanted to uh, go down and do some mining, but as you can see, I um, got back the stuff that I mined, because uh, as you can see, like um, the slime walls are still there, the emeralds and the uh, diamonds, I forgot to mention that. Uh, also, the, uh, the I don't know if I've said this before in like a previous video, but um, the Lost Chapter in Just Shapes and Beats, I already played it. And that was fun. It was awesome. Yeah, I know you're there. You don't have to keep on grunting and groaning and growling to pay us attention. Uh, let's see. Uh, I've got... I don't really know what more to do today. Maybe I'll just kill those pillagers and actually call it an episode. Hey, guys. I'll take out your enchanted bowman first. Shoot me point blank with arrows. Well, when my shield is up. Huh? Where's your other one? Wait, does that thing penetrate my shield? Don't know if there was a weapon that did that, but, um, wait. Where's your, where's your raid captain? There's the, um, wandering trader, and this is a different one. But seriously, where's your, like, raid captain? I would have figured you had one. Like, all the others. Does this place seriously not have a raid captain? These guys are just gonna take each other out. <laughs> you guys are just gonna take each other out. I don't even need to do anything. Is that, is that like a new perk or something? Because I don't recall, um, the raid cap- the raiders never having raid captains. Oh, yeah, the- I thought- I thought- I thought the pillagers always had a captain with them. The bannerman. Strange. But, uh, anyway, I sort of did what I wanted to do in this episode. I just got some more ender pearls. Uh, in the next few episodes, I'm probably going to be doing a bit more mining, maybe going down, trying to find some, um... Find some more ender pearls, maybe, uh, find another... Maybe find a few more blaze. I might just be doing a bunch of piglin training, like, off-cam. Because I know that stuff is pretty boring, and you guys probably don't want to watch it. Hello, goat, how you doing? What the heck? Did you just fall from there? I don't know. Uh, anyways, yeah, uh, like I said, I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, might do some fishing in the next episodes. Some close quizzes down there. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Sure to like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell, all that jazz. And if you are feeling generous, please do, um, suggest this channel, um, to your friends and family. Uh, because, and of course, please subscribe. I mean, it's 100% free. You can always unsubscribe later. And I spend hours working on these videos. Um, and I know every YouTuber asks this as well. How'd you get into my house? Is this an invasion? 
Get your fat green ass out of my house. How'd that guy even get in here? I didn't expect him to do anything, primarily due to the fact that uh, he's, you know... They're afraid of creepers. That's what they do, they just sort of cower on the corner while I kill the creepers. The cats are useful against the creepers, but anyways, like I said, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell, watch us if you are feeling generous, why not suggest this channel to your friends and family? Uh, like I said, Subscribing is absolutely free, only takes two seconds, and you can always unsubscribe later, and it means so much. Uh, but thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you on the next one. Deuces!